I feel like we're in a pretty good spot. I think the last week, especially guys have, you know, it's been time. It's been time to hop out of here. And obviously, I mean, the biggest thing is is really just making sure our starters got that last start to continue to build up from a, you know, pitch count standpoint and, and finish off spring training in that way. But I feel like our position players, our regulars, you know, especially because by and large, um, they all were playing early in camp. Um, I felt like they were built up and ready ready to go, you know, probably 10 days ago or so. So, um, yeah, I feel like, I feel like we're ready to go. And I know everyone's really excited to get to New York. Uh, you know, um, I've gotten built up here now these last few, few weeks as well. Um, no, but, you know, as I said, when it happened, it was, it was a game changer for me immediately. And it's remained that way. Uh, I, I feel good. And, um, excited along with the guys to get this thing going um feel like his catching is, is has gone well uh i feel like his work has been really good these last week 10 days hasn't swung the bat great i feel like his timing's been a little bit off so you know he's getting been uh you know racking up some strikeouts but you know i also feel like even today with with a double play and a strikeout i, I felt like he, he was getting off some better swings better timing getting into some better positions and for him, it's a matter of getting into a good, solid hitting position. And if he can do that, the results will follow. Aaron, let me just follow up. Do you feel at times you guys are trying to talk yourself into him because there is talent there as opposed to that talent actually ever coming together at one time? I don't think talking in. I mean, there, there's no question there's been peaks and valleys there, obviously, but there's been real peaks there. There's been, this is an all-star catcher a, a, a couple of different times. Um, we've seen the progress he's made behind the scenes defensively. So we know what he's capable of. So certainly we're betting on that upside and, and bringing that out of him. Um, so now we get to go find out and, and, you know, hopefully he can go out and start putting last season behind him. I'm not going to really say that. I think you guys all, who cover us every single day know who's very much in that mix um and and we'll have a decision here to make in the next you know obviously a couple days as we kind of weigh everything and just try and put ourselves in the best position to to start the season um you know kind of optimizing us as best as we can so those will be conversations that continue in the next couple of days i think internally you can certainly understand uh who those guys might be not sure exactly what my message will be uh, opening day. Um, that'll happen. Well, I guess I'll probably do it um, on the workout day. Um, but it'll be, you know, in line with, you know, who we are, who I am, and, and you know, how we want to approach things. We, we understand, I think we're all like-minded, and that we want to be a championship team. We understand there's a lot of baseball to be played to hopefully have that opportunity to play for that that at the end of the year um and you know so i just want us to be in the right mindset as we get ready to take on the grueling challenge of 162 game season i i feel confident that we're cut out for it and ready for it and i feel like we've prepared properly in spring training to be ready for that um but now it's about um following through and living that out um, consistently. It's easy to talk about, but it's another thing to go live it each and every day about how we want to approach um, each and every day of the season. And uh, that'll be the continuing message. We're hungry. Um, we understand we're a talented team, um, but we also understand, you know, we haven't done anything yet. We, we, we hope that we've started to lay a foundation to be a championship club. Um, it's a lot of guys that have obviously, in a lot of cases, been here now a few years and have experienced a lot of highs, um, of playoff success, playoff failures, um, you know, disappointing ends to the season. Um, we've gone through a lot together as a team. We've added people to the mix that we feel like can be um, ingredients to help us get over the hump. Um, but I would say this team, and it, I've, I've felt this way the last couple of years, is a very hungry group. Uh, we won't want to kick that door in in the worst kind of way. And um, I, think, I think the fans will see that um, 
hopefully with how we play the game.